play's amazing. What are you doing, Art? Light it up for another edition of your favorite show on the planet, Wild, Wild Side. Side. By now, it wouldn't be a true wild side spring break, or bike week for that matter, without the Hawaiian Tropic Bikini Pageant. We aim to please. Erica is the reigning champion. She has a lot of responsibilities. You can't just come and goof off anymore. Now you're the, are you the what do we call you, the queen? I'm Queen Bee. <laughs> call you that, right? Now, what's, uh, you've, you've been where these girls are right now. What's going through their minds as they stand there? Um, oh my gosh, does my butt look big? Uh <laughs> <laughs> exactly, right? Like, am I going to trip on stage? Are these guys going to cheer for me? Are they going to be rude? What am I doing? And part of performing is knowing your audience. So when these guys go out there, do they roll out a different game when it's a bike week crowd? Like, is there a different way you play this? What do you do? A little bit more sass. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, yeah. The genius behind Hawaiian Tropic right there is Ron Rice. He's the guy that was uh, mixing this crap up in his garage in a bucket. And he built it into this empire. And now everywhere you go, if you see a hot girl wearing red and white like that, you know it's Hawaiian Tropic. And by the way, if you're wondering why my skin is so beautiful, I have Hawaiian Tropic to thank. Thank you. Little SPF 30 in the house. someone who's scared to death. Have you ever gone out on stage in front of people like this? No, no. And, and it's not like you're just going out there, you're in a bikini. Yes. <laughs> yeah. What are, you trying, what are you doing to relax, to not think about the thousands and thousands of people out there Thanks. staring at you in your bikini? Thanks a lot. That makes us feel so much better. Are you stretching? You're limbering up on me. <laughs> I'm doing my last minute squat. <laughs> my butt all 
nice and, and firm. And now, this year's Miss Daytona Harley Davidson, $500 in cash, and a trip to Hawaii to compete in the Hawaiian Traffic Finals. Number 13, Vanessa! You just won. Tell everyone at home real quick, what does this mean for you? It means I'm going to Hawaii. <laughs> Show us how happy you are right now. <laughs> Congratulations. Thank you so and the good much. news, you're here, you're here in paradise right now. Oh yeah, oh yeah. The annual bike week has been around since 1937, and it seems to get bigger every year. Choppers, customs, rice rockets, whatever, it's all here. Throw in the spring break element, and all hell breaks loose. Ahem, uh, note to self, sleep it off before proposing. The whole motorcycle industry, whether it's Harley, Yamahas, everything, the whole industry is growing. We get seven, seven 750,000 people here. They come in here for Bike Week, they come in here for Biketoberfest, and that's a pretty good influx of business, but everybody comes for this event, and when you put that many people in a city in one town, it, it just, it's just phenomenal how well everybody does. Uh, explain for me your style of bike building. I just like to do a lot of one-off stuff. Uh, I like. I like every creation to be different, and so when I start a project for a customer, I, I really maybe let him, let him give me a couple guidelines and I just do what I want to do. They're usually happy when I'm done. My tools in this trade, these are, this is pretty much it. This is all I have. I have the microphone. Is there something we could do with the mic? Is there something, I mean, what, do, what would you envision? Some, something coming off of here? Bikes coming off it, we'll send it over to Bob and have him stripe it. I want to talk specifics. Like, for example, is this one of your bikes right here? Right. Tell me, tell me what what you built. I mean, I know you could order parts for bikes like this. What did you build on that bike? We built everything on that bike. You know. Uh, did you really? Everything, everything but the motor and transmission. The motor came from a motor company. The tranny came from Baker. But you're uh, building wheels. You're building tanks. Yeah, we do the front end, the tanks, the frame. The fenders, we do all the metal work. That's what we do. All the billet parts on the bike, we have the machines that make all the parts. You, you get a little crazy? Oh, from time to time. I've been known to be arrested. <laughs> <laughs> what were you arrested for the last time around? Uh, usually it's uh, street racing or acting up. Nice. Look at even sitting on a badass bike like this, I'm still not badass. We're having a great time here in Daytona, but we're going to go uh, all the way down to Mazatlan, check in with Jennifer Brown. From what I understand, she's having a good time and she found some uh, a little bit of craziness, so take a look. Come back and see me in a little bit. Come on, yeah! Hey, we're here at Mazatlan on the Fun Bus. We're on our way to the uh, Dosecki Beach Party. I got the Hawaiian Tropic Girls. We're gonna go play some volleyball. All right, well, we're gonna go check it out. Come on. Mazatlan, Mexico. Oh, it just sounds tropical, doesn't it? The gentle seashore, quietly lapping you to a dreamy sleep state. I don't think so. This is the wild side, and you know what that means? Drag yourself from the sand to the club and don't pass out till dawn. Let's get this party started. I heard you just streaked through the uh, volleyball game. Hey, hey, Can you tell me about that? Hey. Uh, yeah, I'd be happy to tell you all about it after we make out. <laughs> Are you guys having a good time here on spring break? Having a great time. A lot of pretty honeys around. Yeah. Can't beat that. You know? What do you think about the Hawaiian Tropic Girls? Absolutely amazing. Margarita! <laughs> so what inspired you to uh, go naked in front of all the Hawaiian Tropic Girls? Because they're hot. Are we going to make out first? Spring break is out for baby. Okay, I got off the plane, I walked, I got off the shuttle, and within 20 minutes, I, I took uh, probably about five shots, four hitters, an Adderall, a Zantac, and I was just f***ed up. Within the first half hour, I got here. Wow. Hey, Mom, appreciate it. You guys come down to Mazda, man. Get drunk, go out, have fun. It's what it's about, man. I refuse to comment until she makes out with me, so hey, I'm on strike. I'm on strike. So here, who are we gonna talk to? <laughs> In Mazatlan, it's hard to tell the difference between the restaurants and the nightclubs. 
But why be picky when you get the best of both worlds? Here at Gringo Lingo, it's time to fuel up for the night ahead. You guys having a good time in spring break? You have to be a yeah, yeah, we're having a great time! Great. I spent the last year of my life traveling around the world, partying at different discotheques, different clubs, whatnot, all over Mexico. I'm sorry to say, right now tonight, by far the best night all over. I don't know who volunteered me for this job, but a girl's got to do what a girl's got to do. Oh, but don't you worry, I had my sweet, sweet revenge. Ringo Lingo! Here's to you, Art. Key West is probably the best known small beach city on the planet. It's been nicknamed the Conch Republic and Margaritaville, the latter quite appropriate given the attitude of locals and visitors alike. You know, all these people have one thing in common. They have come here for some good times. You can't get more southerner than this! This is it! It ends! America ends here! And we're partying! So what's up? is Mayberry on acid. These people are crazy, but everybody's nice. Duval Street, what is that all about? This street is out of control. It's so much fun. There's people everywhere. It's the best time. Key West is awesome. Everyone needs to come here. There's the hottest guys, the hottest girls. It's so much fun. To be a Florida Gators and it's great to be the Florida Gator fans in What is your mission here tonight? To get wasted and hook up, baby. My mom can't see that. What's up? We're in Key West Spring Break 2004. I'm here with an insane crowd right now. I love you, Key West. <laughs> Here, basically, my job is talking to drunk people, so right now, I'm really doing my job. Exactly. Yeah, there you go, there you go. What is the capital of Massachusetts? Oh, I don't even know. Uh, why, you gotta, why you guys question? Why you guys are just, you why know it's over. <laughs> They've closed the whole street. There are Hawaiian Tropic girls everywhere. Somebody pinch me. Is this for real? Look at this. Come on. Show the folks at home, please, um, what kind of bikini you're wearing. Because this is this is crazy. This is a homemade bikini. <laughs> you see her? You see her eyes when you turn around? She went. You look fantastic. I am, but I'm cold. <laughs> it's a big difference of being in a uniform and a bikini. <laughs> <laughs> what uniform? to play for the University of North Carolina Tar Heels. Nice! Yeah. What sport? Basketball. I was their two guard. Yeah. I thought you were going to say you were a cop. No! <laughs> and the winner of Miss Hawaiian Topics Spring Break 2004 is Cindy Cruel from Big Time King! Give it up for Cindy Cruel! Folks, time to check in with Jen Brown and see what she's up to. Oh, Jen! Bora Bora. We are about to go check out what the uh, Mazatlan nightlife and spring break is all about. Are you girls ready? 
Yeah, we're gonna tear it up in here. Let's go, ladies. So come check it out. Are we on the wild side or what? You're so wild, baby. I love it! Muzzle on where it gets down. It gets crazy and it all happens. Art, we are so on the wild side. what your club is. Razzles. Razzles has been around for 18 years. We've been taking care of spring breakers for a long time. We know how to do it here in Daytona Beach. We welcome all of you to join us whenever you get the chance. We're the largest club in Daytona. We always give the best spring specials. We know how to throw a party. We always have national promoters here every year for spring break and they give out all the good deals to all the kids, and uh, we take care of you guys. Right, what is goal number one when you come down here? To get laid! Get laid. Yeah. Yeah. Why are you there? Why are you there watching this on TV? You should be here right now. What's goal number two? We got what's called the Razzles Yard. It's six shots of alcohol, and it'll guarantee to knock you on your beep. Nothing touch that Tony Beach. It's as simple as that. I like it. I like it. I approve. And if you have any time, what's goal number three? Get laid again! <laughs> you want to touch a button? Let's touch it. What am I doing? Oh. You're going to hit play right there. What? Just like that. Oh, I was supposed to wait for the countdown. That's all right. Whose milkshake is better, mine or yours? <laughs> I don't want to find out. <laughs> I 
the sound system in this place is phenomenal. You take, you go on the center of the dance floor, I could literally, if you're the only one out there right now with the power we're running, I could remove your clothes. <laughs> He's got it all going crazy over there. And look at this screen. How you doing, man? How you doing? Hey, just while you do each thing, just describe what you're doing. All right, basically what we're doing is we're running the light show for the entire club. We control every single light out there. This touch screen display, all I have to do is pick whatever I want, whatever color I want, however high energy I want it to be, change however I want. I can even put smoke out on the floor. Yeah. can do it all. We got strobes. We got it all. Do you want to try it? Yeah, can I do the smoke? Yeah, just hold the smoke down, right? Just hold the button down. I can have the fire marshals in here. Have you called home and told anyone about what's going on down here? Yeah, fortunately, I called my mom and let her know what's going down. <laughs> what did you say to your mom? I just said, oh, we're being really good. We're not doing anything bad at all. Sorry, mom. I don't even know if we can show that. What does that sign mean? That sign means that um, I'm working for my tits. You see? C cup right now, and what I'm wanting to do is get a D cup. So I said, tips for tips. So I'm trying to get all these guys to tip me a little more, so I can get these. Are we getting close? Are we close? Well, a few more nights and I'll be there. Okay. I mean, I, I think you look you look fine right now. I don't know. I like you. Oh, thank you. Wow. Hey, hello. Hey, that's it. From Daytona Beach, Florida! I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did! See you next time! <laughs>